Here's problem nine. It says this figure shows parallel stair railings through points M, N, P, and Q. It gave us 61 degrees here. Now, these are all parallel as we can see. What is the value of X? Okay, these stair railings are all parallel. It gave us 61. So what can we conclude? Well, this is a transversal right here. If you want, you could just imagine these being extended and you got a transversal right here. If that's 61, then you and I know on since the bottom right is 61, the bottom right here corresponding angle is 61. Um, if we wanted, we could also have labeled that 119. We can pick those up, move them down here again, 119 and 61. Looks like that X is going to be 61, which is choice C. Now please note, X is an acute angle. That means there's no way in the world it's 119. Also, when I look at X, it almost is at 90. It looks like that's going to be 90. So it's almost at 90, which means 29 makes no sense, and half of it makes no sense either. So even if I were having to guess here, C looks like the best, ang the best answer for the angle measurement. But again, we want to be able to figure it out. But if we can't, and we have to take a guess, we might as well sort of look at the angle and say, hey, what does it look like? It's an acute angle, so it's less, you know, it's less than 90, so we can take that one out. It looks a little bit more than 45. Take 45, 29 out, we're left with choice C. But again, we'd rather us be able to reason our way to that, which we did.